about them. I like it because it's because uh, it's fresh, because it's um, grown locally, mm -hmm. also because it's organic, and um, it's supporting a you know a local local project. Did you find this interesting? What? what sorry, what? Did, Did you I? find this interesting? What the salad bag? Yes. Uh, well, uh, tasty, I'd say, mm. rather than interesting. Mm. <laughs> okay. So, what's in the salad bag? Uh, well, uh, we get a little um, thing like this, which tells us what's in it, and so we can recognise all the. Different. Sometimes you can't. Um, don't always know what the leaves are, but because we get this, it tells us. Like, for example, Japanese greens, we get and things like that. Oh. So, so that's quite useful to have. And this week we've got, we've got um, spinach, radish rhubarb, chard, raw beans, leek and lettuce. So. locally grown, so I know it's got no pesticides on, I also know it's got no food miles, it's literally just come from up, it's been picked this morning um, and it's just come down the road, not about a mile down the road, because um, most things you buy, they've actually travelled quite a long way, they can come from Spain and I don't fancy getting vegetables from Spain or Africa when I can actually get them locally, so I know it's really really fresh, I mean the main thing is that it doesn't keep very long, you have to put it in the fridge but that's better because I know it's not been sprayed with pesticides. Um, and it's variety, you get everything that's in season. So everything here I know it's not been forced or brought on, it's actually growing in season. Um, so it's better for you, good for your health. So those are the reasons why really. But, um, what do you like about them? What do I like about them? Well, um, it's all different stuff and, and Andy often says what you can do with them. For example, I never know what I'm going to get. Um, I mean lettuce is easy as salad, but say for example chard. I wasn't really sure what I would do with that. This. What would you suggest, Andy? Boil it like spinach? Yeah, you can fry it. You can like, um, do it in a wok. You know, like fry it in a fry. wok? Okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So there's lots of different ways of doing things. It's just a bit different, because I probably wouldn't go to the shop and buy this, but it's going to make me taste a very different vegetable, something I wouldn't normally have. Mm -hmm. And I like to support the local economy as well, because if you think it's local people, there's volunteers working in the gardens, um, yeah, I want to support the local economy. 